everybody, it's me, Skyzy. You probably know me best from the Encanto Hunger Games. Well, today I decided I was feeling a little bit festive and my mind was on Christmas movies. Then I thought, what if I put some classic Christmas movies in the Hunger Games and made them compete for the title of the best Christmas movie? If you know me, you know I let curiosity get the best of me. Well, today, curiosity really did kill the Skyzy and I actually decided to generate a Hunger Games with all these movies. Our candidates are The Grinch, Polar Express, A Christmas Carol, Home Alone, The Nightmare Before Christmas, Claws, Charlie Brown Christmas, Jingle All the Way, Elf, Krampus, It's a Wonderful Life, Santa Paws, Rudolph, Frosty the Snowman, Miracle on 34th Street, Noel, Arthur Christmas, Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas, Shrek the Halls, The Nutcracker, The Princess Switch, Elliot the Littlest Reindeer, Mary Madagascar, and Santa Claus himself. He's not a Christmas movie, but come on, I had to include Father Christmas himself. Well, who do you think will win? What's your favorite Christmas movie? Leave your answers in the comments below. Without further ado, let's get into the Christmas movie Hunger Games of 2022. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. The Grinch takes a spear from inside the cornucopia. Elf clutches a first aid kit and runs away. Jingle like the runs, away, runs away from, from the, the cornucopia. cornucopia. Santa Claus grabs a backpack and retreats. Noel grabs a jar of fishing bait while It's a Wonderful Life gets fishing gear. Home Alone snatches a bottle of alcohol and a rag. Santa Paws runs into the cornucopia and hides. Krampus sets an explosive off, killing the Princess Switch and Merry Madagascar. Nightmare Before Christmas finds a bow, some arrows, and a quiver. Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas clutches a first aid kit and runs away. Charlie Brown Christmas grabs a jar of fishing bait while Rudolph gets fishing gear. Polar Express rips a mace out of Miracle on 34th Street's hands. A Christmas Carol grabs a sword. The Nutcracker runs away with a lighter and some rope. Claus throws a knife into Frosty the Snowman's chest. Frosty, no. Shrek the Hall snatches a pair of sighs, says, sighs. I, I, I actually don't know. There was not a lot of deaths considering it's literally called the bloodbath. Krampus attacks the Nutcracker, but he manages to escape. Charlie Brown Christmas receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Santa Paws makes a slingshot. Nightmare Before Christmas camouflages himself in the bushes. Rudolph is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Oh, poor Rudolph. Miracle on 34th Street and Claus decorate a Christmas tree together. Polar Express practices his archery. Santa Claus falls into a frozen lake and drowns? Uh, Santa Claus does... Does that mean Christmas is over? Wait, Christmas is cancelled? Uh-oh. The Grinch is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Elliot the Littlest Reindeer discovers a cave. Home Alone searches for a water source. A Christmas Carol sets an explosive off, killing Elf and It's a Wonderful Life. Elf was actually one of my favorites growing up. That's... that's pretty sad. Arthur Christmas and Shrek the Halls work together for the day. Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas and Jingle All the Way decorate a Christmas tree together. And finally, Noelle receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. That was a very sad first day. I mean, Santa Claus died. Elliot the little reindeer tends to his wounds. Jingle all the way, Krampus and Noel discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Nightmare Before Christmas sets up camp for the night. The Nutcracker, Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas, A Christmas Carol, Claus, and Shrek the Halls sleep in shifts. Charlie Brown Christmas stays awake all night. Me too, Charlie Brown Christmas. Rudolph lets Polar Express into his shelter. The Grinch convinces Home Alone to snuggle with him? Uh... Arthur Christmas sees a fire but stays hidden. This is fine. Santa Paws thinks about winning and Miracle on 34th Street goes to sleep. A Christmas Carol spears home alone in the abdomen. Rudolph is pricked Ooh. by thorns while picking berries. Nightmare Before Christmas steals from Shrek the Halls while he isn't looking. Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas sprains his ankle while running away from Elliot the Littlest Reindeer. He doesn't seem like that much of a threat though. He's he's the Littlest Reindeer. Polar Express dies from hunger. Miracle on 34th Street and Krampus build a snowman. Noelle practices her archery and Charlie Brown Christmas goes hunting. Krampus is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Nightmare Before Christmas destroys Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas supplies while he is asleep. Santa Paws attempts to start a fire but is unsuccessful. I mean, I really hope a dog doesn't know how to start a fire. Charlie Brown Christmas defeats Jingle all the way in a fight but spares his life. Miracle on 34th Street and Shrek the Halls run into each other and decide to truce for the night. Arthur Christmas runs away from Shrek the Halls. Santa Paws camouflages himself in the bushes. Rudolph and the Grinch play in the snow together. Aw, two classics just playing together, having fun. Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas hunts for other tributes. The Nutcracker stalks Noel. Okay, that's that's kind of creepy. Elliot the Littlest Reindeer steals from Charlie Brown Christmas while he isn't looking. A devious deer, I see, much like myself. Rudolph sets an explosive off, killing Claus and Elliot the Littlest Reindeer. This is a reindeer on reindeer crime. I will not stand for it. Krampus looks at the night sky. Nightmare Before Christmas tends to his wounds. Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas attempts to climb a tree, but falls on Miracle on 34th Street, killing them both. That's actually really unfortunate. 
Shrek the Halls discovers a river. Nightmare Before Christmas makes a wooden spear. Noelle and Rudolph hunt for other tributes. The Grinch and Jingle All the Way decorate a Christmas tree together. Charlie Brown Christmas practices his archery. Santa Paws and Arthur Christmas are also decorating a Christmas tree. We're all getting in the Christmas spirit, I see. The Nutcracker defeats Santa Paws in a fight, but spares his life. A Christmas Carol loses sight of where he is. The Grinch lets Noelle into his shelter. Shrek the Halls climbs a tree to rest. Arthur Christmas and Rudolph huddle for warmth. I would love to snuggle Rudolph, but at the same time, he kinda has murdered quite a few people. Santa Paws runs away from the Grinch. Krampus travels to higher ground. Nightmare Before Christmas practices his archery. Shrek the Halls and Charlie Brown Christmas build a snowman. A Christmas Carol tries to spear fish with a trident. Jingle all the way, Arthur Christmas and the Nutcracker hunt for other tributes. It's day five and we still have quite a few people remaining. This is looking good so far. I'm still really sad that Santa died though. Santa Paws dies from thirst for Santa Claus, now Santa Paws. I'm in distress. Jingle all the way, tracks down and kills Charlie Brown Christmas. Krampus stays awake all night. Noelle and Rudolph build a snowman. Nightmare Before Christmas forgot to deck the halls. Uh-oh. It makes sense considering so many people insist that it's actually a Halloween movie. Shrek the Halls thinks about winning. Honestly, I believe in Shrek the Halls. I think Shrek the Halls can do it. The Grinch cooks his food before putting his fire out. The Nutcracker tends to his wounds. Jingle all the way questions his sanity. Krampus stabs a Christmas carol in the back with a trident. Where'd he get that from? Shrek the Hall sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Yeah, that's probably best. Arthur Christmas didn't believe in Santa Claus. Hold on a second. Isn't Arthur literally Santa's son or something? Wait, I don't know. I haven't watched the movie in a very long time, but I, I'm pretty sure that they're like kind of related. I'm looking too into it. Anyway, the Grinch tries to sleep through the entire day. Honestly, me too. Me too, Grinch. Krampus throws a knife into Jingle all the way's head. Well, that's unfortunate. Shrek the Halls questions his sanity. Maybe it's because he's the only Christmas special surrounded by actual Christmas movies. The Nutcracker thinks about home. Noelle and the Grinch run into each other and decide to truce for the night. The Grinch travels to higher ground. Krampus diverts the Nutcracker's attention and runs away. Shrek the Halls practices his archery. Noelle also travels to higher ground. Krampus attacks Shrek the Halls, but he manages to escape. The Nutcracker, Noel, and the Grinch go ice skating. Aw, oh, that's pretty wholesome. Ooh, arena event. The arena turns pitch black and nobody can see a thing. Noel survives. While fighting, the Grinch and Krampus lose their balance, roll down a jagged hillside, and die. And Shrek the Halls and the Nutcracker both survive. Dang, these arena events are really hard to survive. <laughs> The Nutcracker's unable to convince Shrek the Halls not to kill him. Oh my goodness, I guess it's just Shrek the Halls and- Oh. Noelle falls into a frozen lake and drowns. The winner is Shrek the Halls. Honestly, I, I said I believed in it as a joke. I wasn't expecting it to actually happen. Well, there you have it. Shrek the Halls is the winner. Do you think it deserved to win? Let's talk about it in the comments. Thank you all for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to subscribe. It's completely free and it really helps me out a lot. Merry Christmas to anyone who celebrates it and happy holidays to anyone who doesn't. As always, the links to my Twitch, my gaming channel, my vlog channel, and my Discord server are all in the description below. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!